Alright, before this video starts, you know, meme alert, meme alert, meme alert. Okay, let me stop. Anyway, the meme should be up right here, guys. You already know what it's gonna be up. It's gonna be. Anyway, so yeah, the meme is going to be up, guys. If you wanna send me memes, you can DM me on any of my socials. It has to be related to my channel, me, or my friends, and I will post it on a YouTube video. I only post one every day. Because I post daily and I only post one me a day. So other than that, guys, um, I am I did do the giveaway or am doing the giveaway. The giveaway's done. But anyway, we hit 600 subscribers, uh, literally two days ago, one day ago, and um, I was doing the Ash account giveaway on Grand Summoners, and then the giveaway winner is user. LOL some numbers and I don't know your full name <laughs> but um yeah so user you wanted you would know who you are uh, I will DM you later on today um but other than that did my video just switch but other than that guys um before this video starts please hit that like button and subscribe let's get to 700 subscribers real soon um literally I want to hit 1k subscribers so guys share with your friends your family your aunt nephews aunties everybody everybody share with everybody don't take all the videos and you know fun and the streams all for yourself you know what I'm saying get everybody out here get them in here and you let's let's have some fun you know what I'm saying we can to get to 1k subscribers we gotta hit 700 first we're gonna do another giveaway at 700 subscribers so if you want to enter that giveaway and be a chance to win get, uh, give me some subs you know what I'm saying get some people out here but this is a long intro um but this video is basically just going over what units you really want to the three main uh, banner units that's on the crossover that you really want to go for. And um, we're just going to be going over real quick. Not too long video. Not too short. You already know how we do. Join the crew. Subscribe to me. And let's get straight into the video. Alright guys, as you know... The Goblin Slayer crossover is here, and this is Goblin Slayer, okay? Basically, Goblin Slayer is not a good guy, nor a bad guy. He just killed things. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? He just killed goblins. But anyway, I really don't watch the I really don't watch the crossover. I really just uh, the main animes I do watch is Attack on. Look, we're not here for that. Okay, so we're gonna get into Goblin Slayer, but um, all right. So his attribute is darkness, race, people. Of course, he's a man. And uh, let's just get into his HP when he's max limit break and everything like that, and his abilities. So when he's max limit break, it's 7,177 with max AP, 999 with the breakthrough, attack 2,658, and the uh, breakthrough is 408, defense 2,622 with the defense of 403. Now we're gonna get right here into the skills and arts and the true arts right here. So we're gonna start with the skill. It's called throwing 1.1k dart damage each time you throw the skills. I don't own damage when you break up up to 50%. Break power up up to 50%. Excuse me. Break force 1.2k. Now the arts right here is skull of transition. Water property uh, physical damage of 13.8k. 10 seconds of enemy break resistance 25% due to WN damage 20% up. Break force. 2.8k all right so this right here is the true arts right here guys goblins are all killed okay dark attribute physical damage a 36k damage at the time of righteousness and the damage uh break breaking up i don't like how that is right there breaking up that there is little remaining hp on oneself up to 150 150 60 seconds on unique gauge two up break force of 3,000 so the art gauge goes up two up um, During the true arts, um, so it'd be two up after I'm guessing with 36k damage going off for 60 seconds Only up to 150% uh, So let's get into the abilities so level one revenge one drowning unique recovery you know. So uh, level 70 revenge two at the time of drowning two loose gauges recovered by nature level 80 was revenge level three at the time of drowning three unique gauges recovered by nature level 90 Level revenge level four at the time of drowning four unique gauges recovered by nature level 90 uh, little demon killing damage 50% against demons, okay? so not everything in Grand Summoners, you go against demons, so you're not going to always have that 50% damage, extra damage, you know what I mean? But, yeah. 
So guys, this is like before you awaken them with a five star physical, three star defense, and two star physical attack. When you awaken him, he has a five star physical, five star defense, and a four star physical. Now right here, guys, this is what you need to awaken him right here. Literally just one soul pieces of carries. Oh, I uh, just one rainbow dragon, but ten awakening well, souls. Is that a lot? Is that right? Oh my god. Okay. Anyway, okay, so let's get into the next unit. Alright guys, so the next unit right here is High Elf Ultra. You guys know, we did, if you was in the live stream, we actually watched Jen's video over her. And we're just gonna see what she needs to be awakening and what's her, uh, what's everything, what she looks like, max limit breaks and everything like that. So her attribute is stream, race spirits, okay. Uh, so max limit break, 6,837 HP. Hmm. Anyway, the breakthrough is 999, attack is 2,766 with 424 breakthrough, 2,408 and 3, 371 defense. That is at max limit break right there, guys. So, right here we're going to do the skills, arts, and true arts like usual, guys. So the skill uh, is dual fire, 1.8k tree physical damage or earth damage. Um. Enemy attack power 20% down for 5 seconds, break force 800. Leave it to me. Arts 14.5k, uh, earth damage, stunt the enemy probability, physical resistance 30% down of the enemy who has been fainted in this mystery for 10 seconds. Break force 200 or break force is 2000 and 200. Now we're going to the true arts right here with high elf bow at 33rd. Alright, I messed up right there. So 33k tree damage. That's messed me up. I'm just gonna say earth damage from now on. 33k earth damage for 12 seconds. 100% critical rate for all friends. 20% for avoidance, uh, avoidance rate break force. Uh, 3.5k. So it gives 100% of critical rate to everybody in your team. So that's pretty cool. Um, no, you need that. You need that critical rate. So now we're gonna get into the abilities right here at level one. Daily blow level two, 20% up critical damage. At level 70, daily blow level three, damage 30% up when critical. Okay, so level 80, daily blow level four, critical damage 40% up. At level 90, daily blow level five, 50% damage when critical. Level 90, Kento Moto, Morto. Okay, on avoidance rate. 10% up and hit rate 30% up now we're going into her equipped right here guys so right here before she's limit breaked uh, five star physical three star support and physical attack is a two star now we go right here when she's limit breaks it is a five star attack or excuse me I've been saying limit break awoken when she's awoken right here so you get a physical five star attack and a support five star attack and then physical four star attack right here it only needs one soul piece of wolf one rainbow dragon and one awakening soul and that's gonna be it so let's get into the last unit right here all right guys so Patisse is right here and uh, this is her this is the last unit we're gonna be going over all right so all right here at maximum break she has 6250 damage with a breakthrough and not that 900 excuse me and 470 with the attack of 2380 with the breakthrough of 367 with the defense at 2.5k with the, with 385 breakthrough so we're going to the skills arts and true arts like usual guys you know how it is uh with a heal a recovery of entire hp of 500 so holy light is our arts is does 8.8k light attribute magic damage make the enemy dark with high prob uh, probability since gauge up 25 for the whole friend break force 1.2k righteousness which is her true arts is protection a total of 6.5 damage reductions for all allies 30 seconds oh uh, so she's not uh so she's she only heals herself apparently okay recover I've had 100% up, so she only hears herself, I'm guessing? I thought she was a heal unit. So she only hears herself, but she negates or she blocks damage or reduces damage from from your whole team. I'm guessing, if I'm not mistaken. So uh, we're going to get right here into the abilities. Poison resistance, level 2. Poison res Time reduction, 20% up by poison avoid avoidance. Rate, 20% up. Level 70, poison resistance, level 3. Poison time reduction rate, 30% up. Poison avoidance rate, 30% up. At level 4, is 40% up, 40% up. At level 5, is same thing, 50% up, 50% up. Now level 90 is mating of 
mother god is that say may they a mother mother god okay that's wrong maiden of the mother mother god i don't think that's right but i think it i think it's supposed to be maiden of the mother god or it's supposed to be a different word but i don't i guess it's mother mother but anyway my own sense gauge two natural rays max hp 10 percent up no duplication for in the entire group okay so i guess you can't do that again so we can go right here when she gets awoken and she has a five star recovery three star support two star support so when she's awoken she has a five star recovery five star support four star support um those two support will be real good um to have on your unit especially that five star and that four star that'd be really good to run on her i know that uh, so all of these are one so soul piece of wolf on her too rainbow dragon and ten awakening souls to awaken her guys so guys i am excited for this crossover i think it's cool i think it's fun um i'm glad it came so it gives us the community something to do i really hope it doesn't stay as long as the old crossover was the slime crossover i really don't I really hope it doesn't stay as long as that did. But is it worth pulling off this crossover banner? I don't really know because Vox is supposed to be coming. Or some kind of Blood Knight is supposed to be coming to Grand Summoners for Global this month. Because a Blood Knight comes out each month. So apparently Vox is supposed to be next up in line. But we just got to see guys. And we just got to hope for the best. And uh, try to save up your crystals. Um, and you're out just for, you know... Just to, just in case you want to get Vox or whatever Blood Knight comes next, which should be Vox for Global. Um, disable your crystals, you know what I'm saying? Uh, I'm going to try to summon off this banner. I'm probably just going to do one because I really want to get Vox. And other than that, guys, thank you guys for watching. Please hit that like button and subscribe. If you want more videos like these, just comment down below and like, hit the like button. And just let me know, you know what I'm saying? I do play third games on Friday. And if you want me to play a certain scary game, just leave it in the comments below. Um, just let me know and just come by in the live stream. You can talk to me and everything like that. Or you can DM me on Discord if you have my Discord. You're in Steven Discord and you can DM me on there. But I am making my own Discord. It will be finished soon. I'm thinking about it. It's going to be finished this week. So other than that, guys, I will see you guys later. Have an amazing day. Stay beautiful. I love you guys all. And peace, peace. I'm out.